series, and we expect nothing less here tonight with game number five. Welcome. Lot of bounce on both blue lines here, and we are about set to drop the puck here at center. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. Moscow's got it in their own zone. Takes the puck at the point. Oh, gets a little piece of it and keeps it out of the net. Stops him again. Moves it around along the half wall. Pad save with ease. Receives the pass. Oh, look at this chance. Muffs the shot attempt and pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. And he denied him there. The goaltender is very aware of where that puck is in that low slot area and defends his crease by getting out, being aggressive, and taking away any of the net. Andronov's born leader zone ability means he gives his squad a boost whatever he finds the back of the net. Gusev's known for his accurate passing plays. That's his tape-to-tape -tape zone ability, guys, and it's what makes him effective at distributing the puck. Before I send him back upstairs, you should know I'll be looking to see who will power their team to victory tonight. These are typically easy calls for officials to make as the opponent goes falling to the ice at the hands of your stick. Tough one to take. Yaroslav will send in their power play unit out for the first time tonight. First power play opportunity of the game and to set the tempo, the trend on the specialty team unit. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. Here they come, down the right side and on the attack. Pumped away by the goaltender. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. Still looking for our first goal. Alexeyev's got it and they'll go on the attack here in the offensive zone. Turn that one aside. Things start to get a little physical out there. Right up Main Street and on the attack. Oh, and he just puts it wide of the net. Scooped up along the wall by Chekovic. Great save from in tight. Puck grab by Chekovic. Here's a blast. Denies him on the play. Here we go. Look at this here. Really applying the squeeze down on the offensive end. And they skate it out of the danger zone. And they win the defensive zone faceoff. Moscow's got a hold of the puck. Here we go, one man rush. Puts it on up, it's in, he scores! We don't get many odd man rushes throughout a game, James. You have to capitalize on your opportunity. I thought they executed perfectly. They didn't overpass. The right player took the right shot. The Dynamo have delivered the game's first goal. Well, it took a while, though, Cheryl. We got two teams going at it here. It's been back and forth action. Offense hasn't been easy to come by. So when you get those opportunities, you have to execute. That'll give them a lot of confidence heading into the second. Handles the puck. Sends a pass over. Moscow's got the puck along the wall. Big time save. Oh, my goodness. Well, throw technique out the window. This time, it's all about the competitive will to get to that puck. Moscow's going on the attack as they gain the zone. The fans desperately urging for them to shoot before the clock winds down. Oh, he got a little sliver of it, and it stays out. All right, time to get a clean sheet of ice here as period number one comes to an end. As you heard the horn sound, we'll be back with much, much more as this is going to be a fun one tonight. Had a chance to recharge, and the officials set to drop the puck here on period number two. The second stanza is underway as the puck is dropped. Let's go. Well, Cheryl, already a third of this one played. What do you make of this one? Your has got to be happy with the opening frame, James. I mean, scores! And that's his first career playoff goal, and he'll take it. Uh, he will, James, because the playoffs is just a different beast. It's not regular season anymore. You want to be an and he does tonight. James, this is just an absolute clinic and body position, how to roll off your coverage. 
position. It's perfectly executed as he doesn't have much time to get the one-timer off, but he gets his stick available and he executes. The Dynamo have extended the lead to two here in the second. I've liked their game, James, in all three zones. They've played sound defensively, they've had speed through the neutral zone, and they've executed when they've gotten into the O-zone. And he takes the feed. Raffles lugging the puck. From the left side, it moves to the middle of the ice. A chance! And he shuts the door on that. Goaltender covers up and will get a face-off. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Puts it on net. Oh, that just goes wide! Players work too hard to have the puck on their stick and to get to scoring area. Scores! And look at this. Here we go. They have answered back. Well, they've responded exactly the way the coach and team wanted. To be able to get back on the board, get momentum back in your favor. It's key guys that contribute and have an impact. Well, the goaltender, he's going to want this one back, James. I thought that he was set to position. Just the blast of the shot, it hit him. He got a good chunk of it, but it went in. You can see the frustration in the body language. The lost connection have suddenly turned things around here in period number two, and the momentum certainly looks like it's on their side, Cheryl. It's definitely shifted with that goal as they get within striking distance. And this is the ebbs and flows of the game. you got to work towards the W, and they've done a good job with a lot of runway left. Oh, he caught! a thunderous hit along the boards. It's bone crushing, James. You feel that one right from your toes all the way up to your shoulders. Talk about finishing a check. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Oh, and a board rattling hit right there. Well, certainly was lined up perfectly body back in their favor. Well, how many times have we seen this before? Might as well put it on repeat, James. I mean, he is such a distributor of the puck. He finds the open player, but more importantly, the puck is flat, it's crisp, and it's right on the tape. Moscow's got possession of the puck after that neutral zone faceoff. Takes the feed from his own end. Slides the puck over. Moscow's gonna play it from the corner. Denies him in close. Well, the shooter's in a coveted spot on the ice, right in the middle of it with a good look, and he makes an incredible save by getting square to the puck and turning it aside. Here's a shot. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Slick feed. And nearing the final minute of the second. Scores! And I guess they won't be delayed call and it almost looks as that the defensive structure collapses and man do they take advantage that's what you call having a knack for the net James when you get in tight and you're sniffing around you better get that puck off quickly because you know there's defenders all in around you that are going to come and close Yaroslavl's goal late here in period number two has given them new life here late. They'll need to take that life and re-energize themselves, but it's been all about good habits, not getting frustrated at the score, finding a way to put it in. They just did it. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Back at the point, they set it up. Big stop, just as time expands. Been a fun night in the barn as we bring an end to period number two, and there's still 20 more minutes. <sighs> Players are set, officials are set, third period action is coming up. And the puck is dropped, and we are underway here in the third. Well, with two periods played, Pounder, your thoughts? Yaroslav's looking for the equalizer in this final 20 minutes of play, James, and I thought that their first 40 minutes, they were strong. You know, their effort areas were quality. I thought that they had a lot of grit to their game, but now they got to find a way to drive the paint. they got to have an attack mentality as they're trailing by one. No room for that one to get through. Face-off coming up as the puck goes up and over the glass. Yaroslav's been the better team. 
but not necessarily boasting the better goaltender, trailing early in the third. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. And he comes up with the save! Off a stick and they can't connect. And it's broken up by a nice defensive use of the stick. Tenacious battle for the puck along the wall. Quick pass to Kusev. And the referee caught that trip on the play. We've got a delayed penalty coming up. Play blown dead. Let's get the call. Well, you don't see this very often, James. The first penalty is called. It's a delayed call. And then multiple infractions afterwards. They put themselves in a real tough spot. Wheels an important piece to this power play unit, guys. He's got that zone ability. And it could really be the key to get things going here and give them the advantage. And they win the draw here in their own end. Tries to get it out of their own end. A great sequence by the PK unit. Really aggressive, close quickly on the puck. And they get it down the ice. Oh, he stopped it. What a save on the play. And there's nothing technical about that. That is all about the will to find a way to make that save. Incredible, James. Gusev's got it along the boards. Here's a chance. And there's the save. Control the puck. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Broken up with the stick in the defensive zone. Big save. Well, he typically scores. Scores! And that's his first goal in a postseason ever. And he'll take it. It's much needed, too, James. You get to the playoffs, you want to make sure that your teammates have trust in you and you have trust in yourself because you want to be an impact player. That's a nice start. Nearing the midway mark of the period. Moscow's got a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. And off the draw, they take the puck. Yaroslavl's got it in their own zone. Sends the pass over. Paquette's got the puck. Puts it on net. Nothing. You gotta get a shot on that, James. You get in tight, you have an opportunity in that scoring area, and you don't even get a shot on net, not good enough. Nearing the final 60 seconds in this one. Moscow's got the puck along the wall. Gotta find a way to get back into this one as they trail the extra attackers on the ice. Strong defensive effort. Picked up along the boards by Buryard. And that's poked away. Moscow's in now. The lost connection have taken control of the puck. And as the final seconds tick off the clock, the home fans acknowledging what they just saw tonight. Scores into the empty net, and that should probably wrap this one up. Yeah, well, it'll seal the deal, James. The insurance marker, a lot of fun as well. Goal scoring is fun, doesn't matter how it goes even if it is an empty net. From the dying moments of the game, they get the empty netter, James, and that's just a result of having urgency, making sure they protect the middle of the ice, and hey, they get it down the ice and get the empty netter to boot. Yaroslav has won the faceoff at center. And that's all she wrote on this one as we are in the books. And with the victory, now just one win away from closing out this series, Cheryl. Yeah, and there's two chains of thought here. I mean, you're up 3-2, and you know you're so close to getting through the series and clinching, but yet they're still far away. You have to have the killer instinct, and you do not want to allow your opponent in and force a game seven. Well, that'll do it for tonight's postseason action.
action, but the playoffs roll on, and we will see you at the next game. From all of us here at EA Sports, I'm James Cebalski. Good night.